the peens, the dones, two pips and a rip. The peens, those are peen, a lance of peen, retire peen, a centipede, the dome, the spirit dome, peliperidone, aloperidone, lorazidone, tetrazidone, the pips, eripiprazole, breaks piprazole, and the rip, can't rip frazee. The peens, the dones, two pips and a rip. The peens, the dones, two pips. Pips and a rip. How can you tell which one is which? The beans, the doughs, two pips and a rip. Just look at the two when you need a tip. All of these receptors that you see to the right compared to D2, they don't bind very tight. So when you dose a drug to block D2, the effects of these receptors will be very few. Adding 5-HC2A to the left is essential For EPS and prolactin to be low or gone Gone, gone, gone The beans, the dose, two pips and a rip How can you tell which one is which? The beans, the dose, two pips and a rip Just look at D2 when you need a tip Now all of these receptors over here on the left tap Finding affinity can be important So when you dose the drug to block D2 You can bet you'll see effects from binding it to 60% D2 Occupancy tells you it's clinically relevant And might be instrumental in keeping all of those positive symptoms down Down, down, down The beans, the dose, two pips and a rip And a rip. Just look at D2 when you need a tip The beans, the dose, two pips and a rip How can you tell which one is which? The beans, the dose, two pips and a rip Just look at D2 when you need, you need a tip